ibabalik natin sa pamilya natin. You get elected because they, the people, uh, you know, tingin nila ikaw yung dapat. If you listen 80% of the time, wow, you learn a lot. Help one another and uh, very, very basic. Hindi po pala sagaban ng kahirapan. You should never stop doing it. And uh, you should do something about it. Well, I would like to be remembered as the Chief Justice who, who sacrificed everything. The most accomplished people work their way to achieve great success. So feel their passion, hear their stories, and learn from their life experiences. All that and more, only on Philippine Biography. Tonight on Philippine Biography. Well, uh, may satisfaction in a sense na kung ano ang nasa isip mo, pwede mong gawin. Lalong-lalo uh, na, na when I serve as a uh, Congressman, when I got elected as Congressman of Catanduanes, madami akong plano na dapat gawin. And after several years, yung mga bagay na yun na kailangan ng aming mga kababayan, eh naisa katuparan. So that's one thing na pwede mong ipagmalaki na because of your position, nagkikreate ka ng impact sa buhay ng tao. Catanduanes, located east of Camarines Sur, is known as the land of the howling winds. It takes pride in its unspoiled and untouched magnificent coastline. Though Catanduanes has yet to have a large stake in tourism revenues, several flights a week from Manila and major improvements of thoroughfares around the island are making strides in changing that. The island province has already started making a name for itself among surfers with its big waves. The island is bordered on the west by the Makena Channel, the Lagone Gulf on the south, and the Philippine Sea by the north and east. Looking back on its history, Catanduanes' first name was Isla de Cobos, as given by the Spanish conquistadors during the early 1573 upon their arrival when they saw several tribes residing in woven huts called Cobos. In another story, the term Catanduanes is of Hispanic origin. It is derived from the word tandu, a native beetle, and the samdong tree wherein both were found to be in abundance over the island. Constant reference to Catanduan or Kasamdongan, meaning a place where the tandu and the samdong tree were abundant, resulted to the word Catanduanes. Catanduanes is known as a friendly, down-to-earth place with a number of sites to visit should you choose to stay for a few days. Puraran Surfing Resort, just 45 minutes from the province's capital, Virac, is a breathtaking surfing site in the town of Baras. It is the home of the well-known majestic waves that is popular among surfers. The surfing resort also has a magnificent view of mountains and bays that photography enthusiasts can enjoy. Those on holiday can also find that Puraran can be a place for total relaxation. It's nice, nice. Mm -hmm. I, I very like here. Mm -hmm. How about this place, sir? It's perfect. It's uh, between 0 and 10, it's 11. Probably. Bato Church, conveniently located by the entrance of the town of Bato, marvelously greets everyone who visits, despite enduring the tests of time with wars and natural calamities. It retains its old glory as a massive structure made of mortar and coral. The whole church, which is also considered as the oldest in the province, was built under the Pola system of forced labor for 53 years, from 1830 to 1883. <laughs> Thank you. 
the Pag-asa DOST Weather Radar Station is also located in the province. It is situated in Barangay Buenavista Municipality of Bato, Catanduanes. The radar station, inaugurated by President Benigno Aquino III in May 2012, is considered as one of the most advanced radar stations in the world. It is the eighth radar station installed in the country at an estimated cost of 500 million pesos with funding from the Japan International Cooperation Agency or JICA. The station serves to effectively reduce casualties caused by tropical storms and other weather occurrences passing the Philippine area of responsibility with early detection. The area also offers a breathtaking view of the bay and islets as seen from the structure. After visiting and exploring its rich and enticing sites, one can be a guest of the Twin Rock Beach Resort, located southeast of Iraq and is best known to be one of the developed resorts in the province. With a number of adventurous activities available including zip lining, wall climbing, traversing through a rope obstacle course, riding all-terrain vehicles and kayaking, one can truly enjoy his stay. The beach has cream and fine sand just adding to the cove's stunning beauty in contrast with its green surroundings. Aside from its alluring sights, Catanduanes is also known for a number of delicacies. But nothing screams made in Catanduanes like the special latik with malunggay made in the island province. Dahil nakuha ko yung, yung... Sarap ng malunggay dahil nutritious at saka yung kulay niya, sabi ko green ito eh. Pwedeng, pwedeng uh, maganda ito sa ano, masarap at saka uh, nutritious sa latik. Yun, inumpisan ko na doon. Pero mayroon pa akong isang pwedeng gamitin eh, yung dahon ng sili. We compare the, the, ano, the material. Mas, uh, mas okay yung malunggay dahil nutritious at saka marami ang makukunan kaysa sili kulang Katanduanes an island province with rich and spoiled beauty aside from its wonderful places and rich delicacies the province also takes pride in its people and the land of the howling winds is also home to one of the country's legislators, Lone District Representative Cesar Vergara Sarmiento. Up next... Well, uh, one word service. Uh, anyone wanting to enter uh, the world of politics, laging uh, gamit ang word na service. So, may slogan akong ginawa dyan uh, in... Uh, local parlance, uh, it, it goes this way, na ang sakuyang pagkamuot sa islang katandungan di kumaringawan, perming nasa isipan, kaya sakuyang binabalik-balikan para katanduanes serbihan. Sa Tagalog, ang aking pagmamahal sa islang katanduanes, hindi ko makakalimutan, laging nasa isipan, kaya aking binabalik-balikan para katanduanes serbihan.